Hello, and thank you for joining me today. I'm Lynn Coughlin with Norwegian Cruise Line, and I'm so excited to speak with you and share our exciting news. You are among the first to know that we have a new ship that just opened for sale. Her name is Norwegian Viva. She was designed with you in mind, and she is spectacular. I'm going to introduce you to Viva, so prepare to be amazed. You'll find out what makes her so special. From first class service and the most outdoor space of any ship in our fleet, to a variety of onboard amenities, Viva offers a cruise experience beyond the imagination. We will look at a few of her awesome itineraries, talk about our current promotions and why this is a perfect time to book your next Norwegian cruise. Then we'll wrap up with some questions and answers. So please, as you think of them, submit your questions using the Zoom chat box. Let's get started. Norwegian Viva is the second of a new class of ships, the Prima class that was created to elevate the guest experience. What better way to envision Viva than to watch a short video? Introducing the all new Norwegian Viva. Our next stunning ship in a brand new class designed for you to live life to the fullest. Stay connected to the sea with experiences that bring you closer to the horizon. Stretch out, way out, in our most spacious accommodations to date. And look forward to first-rate service, so you can live it up every second. it up. Norwegian Viva, sailing 2023. I just love that tagline, live it up. It's about living life to the fullest, celebrating, king up, kicking up your heels, and having a fantastic time. Viva is almost an identical twin to her big sister Prima that was revealed in May. Uh, Viva uh, set sail in 2023. Prima begins sailing this summer 2022. As they are part of the same class of ships, they have the exact same ship statistics. They're considered mid-size for us. Uh, it's approximately the same size as our breakaway class ships, but with a thousand fewer guests. So you're going to hear me reference space throughout this presentation. But uh, Viva stands proudly 20 decks tall. She has a crew capacity of 1,386 and a guest double occupancy of 3,215. So that's a very favorable uh, crew to guest ratio. Viva is state of the art and technology advanced. She was designed to minimize her environmental impact through decreased emissions. She's built with cold ironing power capability. And what this means is that she can actually be plugged in to shoreside power when she's in port. And while she's hooked up, she can turn off her main and auxiliary engines. As well, her hull design is, uh, was designed so she could cut through the water with minimal impact. Let's get to know Viva a little more. She was designed with four main pillars in mind that elevate the guest experience. Wide open spaces, the most spacious new cruise ship with 36% more space per guest than other contemporary cruise ships. So it's referred to as a space ratio, which is calculated by gross tonnage divided by the number of guests on board double occupancy. And recently, we have become more aware of our personal space. So the fact that there is a lot of space on Viva is absolutely fantastic. She has the most outdoor space of any new cruise ship, allowing guests to take in the sea and a variety of spectacular experiences. She has rooms with more rooms our most spacious accommodations for a new, a new cruise ship and larger bathrooms too. Service that puts the guest first with the highest staffing levels for a new cruise ship. This means more friendly staff to deliver a second to none guest experience. Thoughtful design, designed by world-class architects and famed artists and designers to provide an incredible onboard experience. From the grandeur of the haven to the stunning indoor and outdoor decor, designed to engage with the senses. Norwegian Viva pushes the boundaries of luxury and style. Variety of experiences beyond expectations, exciting experiences from everyone 
for everyone from bow to stern. The indulged food hall, the upscale open air food marketplace, the fastest slides at sea, and one of the world's first three-story racetracks at sea, at sea, as well as stunning infinity pools. We anticipate when you get off the Viva or the Prima, that you're going to say, wow, that was more than I ever imagined I would get to experience. Again, living it up, living your best life, never missing a sunset, celebrating, exploring, and seeing things in a brand new light. Ocean Boulevard. This is really an evolution of our guests' favorite outdoor area. Uh, we call it on our other class of ships, the waterfront. And on the Prima class of ships, it's double the space. Double in size, it wraps around the entire ship on deck eight. It's an incredible amount of outdoor deck space with outdoor dining, outdoor seating, uh, areas that help you connect with the sea. So grab a seat, a hammock, a day bed, or a private cabana. Here's a picture of the infinity pools. There are actually three infinity pools on the Norwegian Viva. One on port, one on starboard, and one up in the exclusive haven section. Walk across water on our glass bridges. These walkways are just 50 feet above the water line. Imagine what an Instagrammable moment this would be, uh, walking across this glass bridge uh, while the ship is sailing along and the water is moving uh, just, just below you. Savor mouth-watering cuisine at the Indulge Food Hall with 11 artisanal mini restaurants. It's like a food trip around the world. And here's a picture of the outdoor areas uh, for the Indulge Food Hall. What's amazing is that uh, it, with cruise ships, often there are places that are used during the day and then not at night. And there are other places that are used at the night and during nighttime and not during the day. But Ocean Boulevard, deck eight, is expected to be used uh, all day into the well into the night. Here's some more pictures of our uh, dining. Uh, we have Casual, the local bar and grill. It's a 24 hour restaurant. It's one of my favorite places to get uh, breakfast actually on our ships. The Indulge Food Hall, I mentioned that with the 11 mini artisanal restaurants. In the premium uh, food space, we have Los Lobos, which is our elevated Mexican. And then for fine dining, we have Onda by Scarpetta. Onda is, uh, means wave in Italian, and it is the, uh, the first um, Scarpetta restaurant at sea. It can only be found on uh, the Norwegian Viva, Prima, and Encore. Some pictures of the outdoor dining. And I think there's nothing uh, better than dining al fresco as the ship is sailing along. It's absolutely blissful. Now let's take a look at the accommodations. The Haven is our ship within a ship complex. It's our private uh, area. This on the uh, Viva was designed by Piero Lassoni. Um, it's a true private enclave hidden away at the top and back of the ship on deck 20. And this means more privacy for you. More exclusivity, exclusivity with the best views on board. Private elevators whisk you away to your enclave where your personal concierge and 24 hour butler cater to every craving. And with the open air courtyard boasting an infinity pool, guests can expect to stay connected to the sea everywhere they go. Enjoy a cocktail and stunning views at the Haven Lounge and Bar. Dip into the infinity pool and relax in the outdoor sauna and cold room, all exclusively for guests of the Haven. A picture of the Haven Deluxe owner suite. That would be amazing uh, to experience that. All of the rooms on the Viva are what we say rooms with more rooms, our largest state rooms to date. So whether you're choosing from a Haven suite, balcony, ocean view, and a studio option, which is perfect for the solo traveler, there's really something for everyone. The bathrooms are larger too, I should say. Now for the experiences. You will not be bored on the Norwegian Viva. We have a three level speedway. It's on deck 16, 17 and 18 with 14 nail biting turns and 15 riders at a time. We have the drop and the rush which are dueling slides on the one side of the ship and then uh, the dry slide uh, on the, the other side. Imagine this slide, you get on at deck 18, you get off at deck eight, 
six, uh, just a mere seconds later, completely dry. <laughs> so it's a one way to get down uh, 10 stories in uh, record time. There's the Galaxy Pavilion with 40 different experiences and multiple escape rooms. And I know escape rooms are really uh, fun and very popular now. We have the main pool, the main uh, aqua park main pool and the infinity hot tubs. Great slide there called the tidal wave. No shortage of slides. And for those adults looking for an adults only area, there is the Vibe Beach nightclub. Uh, the Vibe Beach Club. And uh, there is a small charge for this, but it does allow for um, it to be capacity controlled. There are additional hot tubs, a dedicated bar, and a really great area for adults to relax. Viva set sail this summer, uh, sorry, summer of 2023 with spectacular itineraries. And they're right now available to book. I've set, selected a few to highlight, which I really think showcases what we are known for, which is extended time in port and a variety of curated itineraries. We have a team uh, that works very hard at Norwegian that's always looking at how can we um, improve itineraries? How can we have the best itineraries out there with the most port time uh, and the fewest sea days? Take a look at these. San Juan, uh, the Viva will be home porting in San Juan and offer seven day um, a, a Caribbean. Um, uh, she's going to be the newest ship sailing from San Juan. And we say that the best way to island hop across the Caribbean is with Norwegian Cruise Line. We've consistently won awards as the Caribbean's leading cruise line. And when you embark from San Juan, you are able to easily get to beautiful places like St. Lucia and Barbados, which are considerably further south and very sought after destinations. This is a beautiful uh, Caribbean itinerary round trip from San Juan. Here's a nine day Europe, uh, Rome to Lisbon. This is magical. And again, the number one reason to take a European cruise is to visit multiple destinations in one trip in a condensed amount of time. And this itinerary absolutely delivers, which each one of these ports being so special. Just to, uh, to call out a, a few, Villafranche, this is a well-kept secret, stunning port on the Côte d'Azur, with sophisticated sidewalk cafes, an incredible yacht stocked in stunning, a stunning bay with great excursions. Livorno, the best thin crust pizza in the world, many say, and just a hop, skip and a jump to Florence with its art and history at the mouth of Tuscany, close to the Leaning Tower of, of uh, Pisa. And Trieste is just a couple of hours drive from Venice. And then when you get to the Malaga and Cadiz portion of the itinerary, the landscape changes with Moorish buildings and gold domes. And Lisbon is so fun with its great food and open market. So I love this itinerary. And how about this one? 10 days, four nations with an overnight in Istanbul and a late departure from Sant Santorini. There's at least nine hours of port. Uh, so you go Athens to Istanbul, to Santorini, to Mykonos, to Tacalon, to Messina, Italy, to Naples, to Livorno, to Villafranche, uh, to Italy. So amazing. Greece, Turkey, Italy, and France in 10 days, no sea days. Uh, and again, the overnight at Istanbul. So again, you're really helping, we're really helping you maximize, maximize your time spent in Europe. This is a great time to book a Norwegian cruise. We have a, one of our richest promotions I've ever seen. With Norwegian, you get more free. Love for you to take advantage of it. We call it the 70% off second guest promotion, but it's actually priced out as 35% off each guest in the stateroom. And again, this is one of the richest promotions that I've ever seen, especially combined with our free at sea benefits of free open bar, specialty dining, shore excursions, Wi-Fi, and on select sailings, extra guest sale free. And right now we also have our free airfare available for the second guest when you purchase airfare for guest number one. And this in itself is a great promotion. Half of all of our guests who are making bookings right now with Norwegian are taking advantage of this free air offer. And I highly encourage you to utilize this promotion uh, and speak with the advisors at the cruise web, the knowledgeable advisors of the cruise web. In addition to all those wonderful promotions, for any booking you make uh, for the next seven days, I'm going to provide you with uh, $50 onboard cre uh, credit and chocolate covered strawberries. So that's even though this uh, presentation is focused on the Norwegian uh, Viva, 
uh, is for this offer is for any ship, any sailing date, uh, any bookings that you make in the next seven days. So Viva, live life to the fullest. Now I'm gonna take a look at some of the questions. I know we had some questions submitted into the chat feature, so thank you very much. Uh, so let's get to as many of those as we can in the time allotted. Here's one, are there additional discounts for groups? Yes, there are additional discounts and bonus amenities for groups. We love groups at Norwegian. We are fantastic at uh, uh, multi-generational groups and the cruise web is excellent at working with our group department. As a matter of fact, as soon as new itineraries are opened or deployed, the cruise web acts quickly and blocks group space. And that's great because it's protecting the price and the space that they're able to offer it to you. So reach out to your knowledgeable cruise web advisor for the very best group pricing. And I know uh, that they have a blocked um, uh, group space on these three itineraries and others of the Viva that I have mentioned. There's a question about uh, Europe and the itineraries and the shore excursion. Tell me about the shore excursion offer. Uh, tell me a little bit more about that. So yes, the shore excursion is a $50 discount off of a pre-booked shore excursion with Norwegian. So imagine if you were on a seven or nine or 10 day sailing or longer, a very port intensive itinerary like the ones that I uh, um, showed you earlier, the uh, savings off of the shore excursion can really add up. So you would get $50 off of a, a shore excursion. You could, it's not limited to just one shore excursion per day. So you could get $50 off of a morning shore excursion. And then if time permitted and there wasn't a conflict, you could pre-book pre uh, an afternoon or evening shore excursion uh, and get $50 off of that. So you can see that $50 to $100 a day times the number of days that you're sailing really adds up and is a fantastic value. Okay, so that's the short term. Uh, let's see, here's another question. Uh, oh, <laughs> this looks amazing, but I don't want to wait until 2023 to experience Viva. Since you said Prima is uh, twin ship and she's, um, and she's going to be sailing earlier, she's going to be starting to sail this summer, would the experience be similar? And the answer is yes, absolutely. They are twins, so the onboard experiences would deliver the very same high uh, a level. The Prima um, is sailing uh, this summer, starting in uh, spring and summer in Europe, and then she has some New York to Bermuda sailings, and then moves to Miami uh, for the winter 2023 sailing in the Caribbean. So if you love what you saw, uh, but you don't wanna wait until 2023, I don't blame you, uh, you can uh, have a very similar experience on their beautiful Norwegian Prima. So we're approaching our time limit. I'm gonna answer one more question, but if I don't get to your question, uh, someone from the cruise web will follow up uh, with you. They are the ultimate travel professional A-team. Um, and so the last question, Viva looks amazing, but you didn't speak about the onboard entertainment. I'm actually glad you mentioned this because Viva is breaking news. So this is the first reveal our next reveal will include more about her onboard programming. I will say that our shows are the best at sea. And no matter what ship of ours you sail on, you'll want to go see the shows. They're really Broadway productions and caliber. And in fact, if you were to see any of them on Broadway, you'd be paying in excess of $100 per person. Uh, but um, on the ship, they are complimentary. We do on some of our ships have a dinner show, a, a, a separate dinner show, and there would be a charge for that but the headlining shows on all of the ships are complimentary to you. So Viva will offer everything past guests have come to love about Norwegian and more. And remember to reach out to the knowledgeable advisors at the cruise web who will be the first to know about any not yet shared details. They are a great resource for you. Thank you again for joining me today. We can't wait to welcome you aboard our ships. <laughs>